Hey there, welcome to our deep dive into the world of veganism. You've probably heard about the fantastic benefits, but today we're exploring a lesser discussed topic, potential nutrient deficiencies and health risk. Whether you're already plant powered or just curious, our aim is to empower you with balanced information. Stick around, it's about to get insightful. All right, so before we delve deeper, let's discuss what a balanced vegan diet looks like. In essence, it's all about diversity. You're aiming to include a variety of fruits, vegetables, grains, and legumes in your meals. These are your key sources for vitamins, minerals, and fiber that keep your body functioning at its best. For instance, fruits and vegetables, as you likely know, are your primary sources for essential vitamins and minerals. Think oranges for vitamin C, sweet potatoes for vitamin A, or spinach for iron. Whole grains, like oats and brown rice, provide slow digesting carbs for lasting energy and also add a punch of fiber, which is essential for gut health. Legumes, including lentils, chickpeas, and beans, are your protein heroes. They not only offer a significant amount of protein but also contain vital micronutrients like iron and zinc. And then, there are nuts and seeds. Ever considered chia seeds a superfood? That's because they are rich in omega-3 fatty acids, a nutrient we'll talk about more later. But remember, while all these foods are helpful, a balanced diet is about variety and moderation. Consuming a wide range of these foods ensures that you're getting a broad spectrum of nutrients, reducing the risk of any deficiencies. So, don't shy away from trying new fruits, vegetables, or even grains and legumes. Your body will thank you for the nutrient boost. Next up on our list is vitamin B12, a vital nutrient that often plays hide and seek in a vegan diet. Here's why it's crucial. B12 is responsible for the formation of red blood cells, DNA synthesis, and the proper functioning of your nervous system. It's a big deal, isn't it? Now, the tricky part is that B12 is naturally found in animal products, and unfortunately, there are no reliable plant-based sources. This is where fortified foods and supplements come into play for vegans. Fortified foods are products that have had nutrients added to them. So, when shopping, you might want to look out for B12 fortified foods like plant-based milks, breakfast cereals, or nutritional yeast. They're not just tasty. They're also a way to get that elusive B12 into your diet. And yet, due to the crucial role of B12, many health professionals advise taking a B12 supplement as an insurance policy. As per review published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition in 2014, B12 absorption can vary greatly among individuals, so a supplement could help ensure you're covered. Remember, though, you should always consult with a healthcare professional before starting any supplement regime. Your health deserves personalized attention and care. Moving on, let's tackle the calcium conundrum. It's a fact that calcium is vital for our bone health, and dairy products are often touted as the go-to source. But, being vegan, where does that leave you? Fret not. Many plant-based foods are calcium rich too. You've got fortified plant-based milks, leafy green vegetables like broccoli and kale, and even some types of tofu. Plus, almonds and sesame seeds are not just crunchy additions to your salads. They're small packages of calcium as well. But here's something to consider. A study in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition in 2018 found that vegans, on average, have a lower calcium intake than non-vegans. And a lower calcium intake could potentially lead to weaker bones. But before you worry, remember, you have calcium sources at your disposal, as we discussed. And, another point to note is the role of vitamin D in calcium absorption. Without sufficient vitamin D, even with ample calcium, your bones may not reap the benefits. So, the solution isn't just about upping your calcium intake but also ensuring you're getting enough vitamin D. We'll delve into vitamin D in a later segment, so stay tuned. We've now arrived at iron, an essential nutrient known for its role in producing red blood cells. Now, iron comes in two forms, heme, found in animal products, and non-hem, found in plants. The hitch, heme iron is more readily absorbed by our bodies, which means as a vegan, you might have to work a bit harder to meet your iron needs. Plant-based foods rich in iron include legumes, fortified cereals, whole grains, nuts, seeds, and leafy green vegetables. Sounds familiar, right? We did say legumes were protein heroes, but here they are again, doubling as a source of iron. But here's a pro tip. Consuming iron-rich foods alongside sources of vitamin C can increase iron absorption. So next time you're having a chickpea salad, squeeze some lemon juice over it, or include bell peppers in the mix. It's worth mentioning that despite these strategies, According to research published in the Journal of Nutrition in 2013, vegetarians and vegans tend to have lower iron stores. So, if you're feeling constantly tired or have other symptoms of iron deficiency, 
it might be worth speaking to a healthcare professional about your diet. Next up, we're chatting about omega-3 fatty acids, crucial for heart and brain health. Seafood is typically associated with omega-3s, but being on a vegan diet, how do you ensure you're getting enough? Your plant-based champions for omega-3s are flax seeds, chia seeds, hemp seeds, walnuts, and algae-based supplements. Notice how we mentioned chia seeds before for their superfood status? Well, here's another feather in their cap. While these sources provide the type of omega-3s called ALA, your body needs to convert ALA to EPA and DHA, the active forms. However, this conversion process in our bodies isn't always efficient. A 2018 review in the Journal of Nutritional Science highlighted this conversion issue, leading to lower levels of EPA and DHA in vegans and vegetarians. But here's where the algae-based supplements can be beneficial. They provide a direct source of EPA and DHA. Remember, omega-3s are essential fats, and the essential part means our body can't produce them, so we need to consume them through our diet. It's worth making sure you're getting enough, and as always, consult a healthcare professional for personalized advice. All right, let's now talk about protein. But where do you get your protein from? Is a question vegans are all too familiar with. So, let's demystify the protein myth. Firstly, rest assured, there are plenty of plant-based proteins out there. Legumes, whole grains, nuts, seeds, and even certain vegetables pack a protein punch. Lentils, chickpeas, quinoa, tofu, tempeh, these are all fantastic protein sources on a vegan diet. However, the crux lies in the term complete protein. Animal proteins are complete because they contain all nine essential amino acids that our bodies can't produce. Most plant-based proteins, on the other hand, are incomplete as they lack one or more of these amino acids. But that's no cause for concern. According to a report in the Journal of the International Society of Sports Nutrition in 2017, by eating a variety of plant-based protein sources throughout the day, you can get all the essential amino acids your body needs. So, it's not about a single complete protein source but rather a mix of different proteins that together provide all the necessary building blocks for your body. As we move forward, let's shed some light on a few lesser known nutrients, zinc, iodine, and vitamin D. While they might not make the headlines as often, their importance for our health can't be overstated. Starting with zinc, it's a key player in immune function, wound healing, and even our sense of taste and smell. And while it's available in a variety of plant foods like legumes, seeds, nuts, and whole grains, the zinc in these sources isn't absorbed as well as from animal products. Next up is iodine, essential for thyroid function. The iodine content in plant foods can vary widely depending on the soil they're grown in. Seaweed is a rich source, but its iodine content can fluctuate drastically. This is where iodized salt or a supplement might come into play. Finally, we have vitamin D, crucial for bone health and immune function. Most of our vitamin D comes from sun exposure, and diet resources are scarce, particularly in a vegan diet. However, fortified foods and vitamin D supplements can help meet your needs. To sum it up, these nutrients deserve your attention, and according to a review in Nutrients Journal in 2016, vegans might need to plan their diets carefully or consider supplements to ensure adequate intake. As always, a discussion with a healthcare professional can help tailor this to your specific needs. Now, let's connect the dots and discuss the potential health risks associated with nutrient deficiencies in vegan diets. While a well-planned vegan diet can provide all the necessary nutrients, if certain nutrients are consistently lacking, health issues may arise. For example, a deficiency in vitamin B12 can lead to fatigue, weakness, and neurological problems. Insufficient calcium intake may increase the risk of osteoporosis and weaken bones. Iron deficiency can cause anemia, resulting in fatigue, reduced cognitive function, and compromised immune function. Moreover, inadequate omega-3 fatty acids may impact heart health and cognitive function. Protein deficiencies can affect muscle mass, immune function, and wound healing. Insufficient zinc, iodine, and vitamin D intake can lead to a range of health problems, from compromised immune function to thyroid issues and weakened bones. It's important to know that nutrient deficiencies and associated health risks are not exclusive to vegan diets. However, being aware of these risks and taking steps to ensure adequate nutrient intake through a balanced diet and appropriate supplementation, if needed, can help maintain optimal health on a vegan lifestyle. Remember, everyone's nutritional needs are unique, so consulting a healthcare professional or registered dietitian can provide personalized guidance to help you achieve a balanced and nourishing vegan diet. Congratulations, you've reached the end of our exploration into the potential nutrient deficiencies and health risks of veganism. Remember, the key to a successful vegan lifestyle lies in balance, variety, 
and informed decision making. By incorporating a diverse range of plant-based foods, exploring fortified options, and considering appropriate supplementation, you can thrive on a vegan diet while mitigating potential nutrient deficiencies. Knowledge is power, and armed with this information, you can make informed choices to optimize your health and well-being as a vegan. Embrace the journey, experiment with new recipes, and enjoy the abundance of plant-based nutrition. Stay healthy, stay vibrant, and keep shining on your plant-powered path.